Hey guys, make sure to like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, and turn on the notifications if you want to see more videos and walkthroughs from the EHG community. Thank you very much. Nice, bro. Nice. Like, like, I hate my dad, bro. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, he just, like, smashes all this shit. What the fuck? So, if you haven't seen this video yet, um, it was a video about, you know, a kid who has his... PC stuff actually destroyed and apparently his father was the one who actually destroyed all his PC stuff now with that issue we had um you know like many reasons of why it could have possibly happened and apparently uh this kid was actually part of a I believe a Fortnite tournament which I believe the prize was a certain amount of money um the father had wanted him to literally leave to be able to go hang out with family or to go visit family so he had a couple of minutes sadly that that, that really couldn't happen because of the fact he was in mid tournament now because of that it frustrated the father and it led to like you know him destroying all his pc stuff that this kid had earned um with his hard-earned money so the question here was was this father wrong Hell yeah, he was. Of course he was fucking wrong for doing that. The fact that that kid earned all that money to be able to go ahead and make a PC um, for himself. Sometimes PC builds aren't even cheap. Sometimes you have to wait for, you know, Black Friday to go ahead and come around. Or for Cyber Monday or for some certain deals to pop up for you to get certain parts. Especially with like certain parts nowadays for like, for like a 3070 is probably more than a grand. Probably certain things like a, like a screen or even top-notch stuff like, you know, a mi microphone, you know, even keyboards cost a heavy penny, especially based on the brand. But this father went ahead and decided to just, just, just straight up destroy this shit just because of the fact that he wasn't getting off in a couple minutes mid-tournament to go visit family. First of all, if there's a grand prize right here and I'm in a tournament and I'm doing things to try to win this grand prize. And let's say the grand prize was like 10000 even even $50,000. Who cares the amount of it? And you're telling me to get off mid-tournament to go hang out with family? Then hell no! Fuck that! They could come visit another goddamn time! You're telling me now... Okay. These tournaments happen a lot. This people don't understand, especially parents don't understand that esports is a major thing. It's an actual thing that can help people go ahead get sponsorships from different types of companies. Sometimes it comes from Red Bull, sometimes it comes from like tech companies like Razer, even tech companies like like or even like platforms like Twitch and they can earn a living out of that. They can actually earn a fucking income to actually pay bills or to continue doing what they're doing it's a really hard and difficult thing for people to actually understand that but it's actually true you can actually do that and this father was 100 wrong for doing this shit i don't care how long the family's gonna be here the family's here for like a couple of days now i guess this tournament could literally just wait no it can't no it can't the family's here for like a couple of days. I think the family could wait like five fucking minutes or like an hour or two when I'm done with the damn tournament. Like, no. Like, no, no, man. Like, you can't be doing that, especially with a kid actually earn his freaking PC. You know how hard it is to possibly earn the money to, like, like literally just, you know, build a PC? This is a sense of abuse where you're literally taking some kid's belongings, especially when he's earned it. Like, like in any type of way where he's earned it and you're literally going to a point where you're just you know making him upset and breaking it and now destroying it to a point because you didn't get what you want and you decide to have a fucking hissy fit now that's that's literally borderline abuse and i, I i've seen a lot of comments on this kid's twitter he was like oh you know it's probably you know his family's his dad's money he's probably you know he probably got the money from his dad you know, parents do try to teach us to earn our own money by giving us an allowance. You know, technically we have earned our money by doing that shit. Yeah, it's our money now. If we earn our money by doing the dishes or mowing the lawn or going around the neighborhood shoveling snow, we've earned our fucking money. 
and this kid was 15 in in a place like in certain places you can actually work at 14 years old so he might have actually earned that fucking money or if anything especially with with becoming a sponsor sometimes sponsors can give you money to be able to earn your own income so he might have probably earned that income to pay for that pc but that father didn't understand it now on a personal note if that was me, I would have broken every fucking thing in that goddamn house. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. My PC setup alone with everything that I have here is, was almost $1,500. I would be fucking damned before anybody just tries to bring my shit. If somebody goes ahead and destroys my, let's say for instance, uh, my screen right here this screen right here this is a this is my drawing pad 300 bucks i am breaking 300 dollars worth of your shit if you break my 300 dollars screen or if not i will take you to court to earn that fucking money but sometimes court fees tend to take all the fucking money anyway it doesn't really fucking matter so literally what this dad did was wrong but in the comments let me know what you guys think let me know how you guys feel Definitely subscribe to the EHG community. Definitely turn your notifications for when we get new streams and new videos set out. Definitely join us on our Facebook group, our Discord channel. Make sure to go ahead and check out our merchandise and follow us on Glimish. But this is Nico from the EHG community. Stay tuned for another video. And remember that there's always something amazing on the horizon.